Did you know, did you know, mm -hmm. did you know <laughs> that church inside the building is, is okay to do now? Did you know that? Yeah. Yeah, you didn't know that? I didn't know. Did you also know, you didn't then, but did you also know that church inside the building for the kids program mm -hmm. is now going on no. on Sunday mornings? No. Yep. No. Now, is it, it's, is it happening for two services or one service? You want to guess? Two. Just one. Oh. <laughs> That's right. So they're learning and you're learning right now. If you didn't know this, so Kids Church at the 1030 service, that's the second service, is now going on. I'm teaching for some of the services, um, some of the Sundays. I am actually teaching. So I want to let you guys know that that is going on. So what does that mean for our online services? What that means, though, is that we're going to start recycling the services, the, the online uh, kids programs, since okay. March. So we went all the way back to the beginning. Really see me. You can't see you? Okay. We're going to go all the way back to the beginning, and we're going to be recycling those again. So if you miss some of those, then this is fine. If you do not feel comfortable coming on a Sunday morning in person, that is okay. Totally fine. Okay. All right. This first song is King Jesus is All. <laughs> King Jesus is all, King Jesus is all, my all in all, my all in all, and I know that he'll answer, and I know that he'll answer, me when I call, me when I call, walking by my side, walking by my side, I'm satisfied, I'm satisfied, King Jesus is all, my all in all, my all in all. I got down on my knees, 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 I said my very first prayer. Hallelujah! You know the Holy Ghost met me there. I, 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 I stepped, stepped on the, the rock. The rock was sound. Woo! Love of God came and tumbled it down. The reason I know that He saved my soul. I dug down deep and I found pure gold. And He's all my all in all. And I know that He'll answer. Walking by my side, I'm satisfied. King Jesus is all, my all in all. Well, I went out to meet the Lord. Oh yeah, I got down on my knees. I got my very first prayer. Hallelujah! You know the Holy Ghost met me there.
with the prayer that we do every single week. So Owen is going to read the first line, or say the first line, and then I'm going to repeat it, and Lucas is going to do whichever line that he wants to. Please join us in folding your hands. Here we go. Lord Jesus. Lord Jesus. Today we desire to follow you. Today we desire to follow you. Search us. Search us. Guide us. Guide us. Show us what we can learn from you today. Show us what we can learn from you today. Empower us. Empower us. Demonstrate your love for us. Demonstrate your love for us. Speak your love for us. Speak your love for us. So we can bring glory to you on this day. So we can bring glory to you on this day. In Jesus' name, amen. In Jesus' name, amen. You may have noticed we're actually doing recording this from our garage because you can pray from anywhere. Is that right, guys? Yeah. Yes, it is. All right. Enjoy the lesson. Hey, good morning. I've got Lucas here. Who's Lucas? Me. Yeah, that's Lucas. Uh, we are outside of... Um, I li we live with Grandma right next door to us. It's all part of the same kind of housing complex. So we're over here. And Lucas, can you tell everybody, what did we do this last week for Grandma? Plant flowers. Oh, yeah? Which ones did you plant? Do you remember? I forgot, but most of them. Most of them? Yes. Did you, did you water them as well? No. No. Do you know Owen who? watered them. So Owen watered them, and you planted them. Now, let me ask you, which job is more important? Is planting the flower more important, or is watering the flower more important, or are they both important? Maybe both. You think both are? Well, let's look. Let's show everybody what, what it looks like now with the planted flowers. Why don't you point, point to the flowers? There you go. Look at all these flowers. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, yeah. Mm -hmm. That's right. So, Lucas, let me ask you. Do you enjoy, did you enjoy planting the flowers for Grandma? Do you think she enjoys them? Yeah. Now, I've got a, another question for you. You planted the flowers, and that was very important. And Owen watered the plants, and that was very important. Who makes the plants grow, though? Did you make the plant grow? Did Owen make the plant grow? Really? Who does it? The store. The store makes it grow. It gave us the, the little bit at the very beginning, but now who's going to make the who's going to make it grow now? Grandma and us. And us, yeah. Do you think maybe God has something to do with it? Uh -huh. Oh, yeah, that's right. We can't forget about God. God's <laughs> the one who actually makes the plants grow, huh? Yeah. All right. Uh, I'm going to have you take the camera now, and I'm going to have you film me, okay? Here we go. All right, now that Lucas is filming, he's going to do a great job keeping it steady, I know. I wanted to read to you out of our Bible. It's from 1 Corinthians chapter 3, verse 7. It is not important who does the planting or who does the watering. That's not true. We were just talking about that. It says what's important is that God makes it grow. Is that true? Yes. The one who plants and the one who waters work together with the same purpose. Both Lucas and Owen work together with the same purpose, the same goal to plant the flowers. And both will be rewarded for their hard work. And then it goes on to talk about how we are all God's workers. Isn't that a great idea? I love that. You could do anything. You can work really hard at planting flowers, or you could work hard at helping your mom bring in groceries, or helping your dad around the house. You could do anything. But as long as you're doing good, you're doing what God wants you to do, God's the one who's gonna be able to make it actually become something even bigger than what it is. It's not our job to, to really do all of the everything that needs to get done. God will take care of that. What do you think, Lucas? Well, we should help our parents and God. Yes, and we should. Our brothers or yes, sisters. We should. I agree. Here, I'll take the camera back. Okay. All right, is there anything else you wanted to say? What should we do? Wait, help others. Yes. All right. And we talked about this before. We did talk about it before. All right. Goodbye, everybody. Bye. This next song is called The Thwart Song. So, cover your eyes, cover your eyes, cover your eyes. The Lord opens up eyes of the blind, and he raises up those who are down. The Lord loves the righteous, protects the stranger, and supports the fatherless and the widow. But he thwarts, thwarts in the way. Yeah.
the wicked. Hee 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 hee. Yes, he thorns. Thorns in the way of the bad. Hey hey, the Lord reigns forever. My God of Zion, unto all generations, praise the Lord. Okay, cover your eyes. Cover your eyes. Cover your eyes. Cover your eyes. The Lord opens up the eyes of the blind. And the Lord loves the righteous, protects the stranger, and supports the fatherless and, and the widowed. Buddy Thorpe thorns in the way of the wicked. Yee, 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 yee. Yes, he thorns thorns in the way of the bad. Keep on pressing on